Are you reaching your divine destiny? Prayer, faith, holiness are key to reaching your destiny. Join Prophet Nana Seopoku Sarkodie and get you closer to your God in prayer. Ignorance is more dangerous than HIV. In fact, you have to be ignorant for the devil to attack you. Because ignorance is the strength of the oppressor. So for somebody to oppress you, whether the devil or human being, anytime somebody is oppressing you, the person knows something you don't know. Jesus said that you are free. You shall know the truth and the truth shall set you free. Or the truth shall make you free. So you can't know the truth and be in bondage. working God. Yes. If any burden follow you to this place, yes. you are going to live it in this place yes. and go back. Yes. 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 For those of you who are standing there and looking at me, I want you to know that everything in the physical came as a result of words. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Hmm. And God called the things which be not uh -huh. as though they were. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. One of the greatest revival in the Bible is in the book of Ezekiel, chapter 37. Hmm. Can these bones live? Hey! So that is the question today. Can you get married? Hey. Yes. Yes, yes. Can you become a billionaire? Yeah. No, you are, you are not understanding what I'm talking about. Can you fulfill the purpose of God for your life? Today, may the word that proceeds out of this puppy change your destiny for life. Can these bones live? Yes. <laughs> Jesus Christ. When he looked at the when he saw the hopelessness of the bones. He couldn't answer yes or no. He said, Lord, thou knowest. I don't want to say no. Then you say, I don't believe you. The way the situation is, to, is I don't have any faith to say yes. So today, if you don't know how to do it, just cast it on God. Leave it on God. Hey! May the Lord solve every problem on your life before you leave it. What are those who shout until the heavens will respond to them? What are those who give the Lord a shout and they believe in shouting? Make a joyful noise unto the Lord. Jesus. Can these bones leave? 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 I hear the Lord say there shall be a performance. There shall be a performance. Somebody will not leave here the same. I declare over your life. Every evil inheritance shall be broken. Deliverance war. made by him hey. and for him he said 37 can these bones live he said thou knowest the next verse what did the Lord say and he said in the next verse next verse and again he said unto me professor 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 hey catch on the said next I shall come shall come Professor. Professor. I say professor. Professor. I am already doing it. So you have to get ready to receive it. I declare today is the last day you see financial trouble. Yes. After the anointing service, your struggle comes to an end. Today is the last day you see what? Today is the last day you see sickness and disease. I declare that every snare on your life will be broken. May the favor of the Lord overtake you today. 
goodness and mercy shall follow you all the days of your life. Yes, sir. Give the Lord a shout if you are alive. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. 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 Show me your faith without your works. <laughs> and I'll show you. Uh, listen. There's a reason for it. Hey. The shouting has its reason. This is what Hannah said. First Samuel chapter 2, verse 2. Let me see something. There is none holy as the Lord, for there is none beside thee. Neither is there any rock like our God. Go to the next verse. Talk not exceedingly proudly. Let no arrogance come out of your mouth. For the Lord is a God of knowledge. Hey. Hey. And by him actions hey. 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 Today may the Lord wear your action to give you a plenty. Yes. If you have to jump, jump. Yes. If you have to scream, scream. Yes. If you have to shout, shout. Hey. I declare the visitation of the yes. Lord. I declare the glory of the Lord. Hey. Hey. Somebody, whatever you can do. Hey. I said give the Lord some praise. Yes. Some shouts. Your miracle is coming. Your miracle is coming. Your breakthrough is coming. Give the Lord a shout. Good to see you, brother. Hey! Give us a smart and clap of him. Yes! Hey! Hey! Lift up your two hands. God is a God of knowledge. <laughs> and by him, actions. Actions. Yeah. Not action, but actions. <laughs> so when you lift your leg like this, an action. Yes, sir. Hey! When you shout, it's an action. Yes, sir. Hey! When you scream, it's an action. Hey! Yes, sir. Hey! Hey. Listen, listen to this. Yesterday, I got, I saw the practice of the things I was teaching you, and I was encouraged. Hey. After Reverend Isu finished preaching, they come and they say, "Daddy, there is an emergency." I say, "In this house." When I came, Doc, I've never seen that thing in my life. Yesterday, you see, it's not like. The only time you enjoy fasting is when you are breaking it. You don't want, you are a hypocrite. You don't want to say, but that is a fact. When we are taking the communion, I can see the way some of you take the bread. So I was hungry. When I came, I saw a lady in a pool of blood. I've never seen anything like that in my life. No, I'm not the kind that fear things. I, not that I was afraid, but I said, no, they said that you can't kill somebody. This is the house of God. I say, hey. I left out the oil and I prayed. When I finished praying for her, I read what he said. I told her, I said, Papa, there's an emergency. Let me go and check it on camp. I came back, they called me again. He said, after you pray, the guy has collapsed. Hmm. I say, Lord, this is the grounds that prayer has gone. Nothing must work here. They say she was pregnant and he was losing the baby. No call hospital. And the doctors told the husband, you have to do something. And the guy just believed that he has faith. You see, don't try to pray to your faith that you don't have. There is a gift, there is a word of faith. There is a gift of faith and there's a spirit of faith. Amen. Amen. And don't impose your faith. For instance, there are some things with all my faith in it. I don't impose my faith on my wife. There are some times she's going through something. Say, I want to go and see the doctor. He has never seen me going to see the doctor since we married. And I trust God, I will never see one. <laughs> now listen. But he said, I want to go and see the doctor. Sometimes I say, okay, can I take you? Because at that time, that is why the faith level is operating. I can't impose my faith on her and you don't have faith. No, 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 no. Because sometimes I operate in a certain supernatural faith. That is not the natural one. God just gives the spirit of faith. It's not the natural faith. It's not natural. It's a supernatural faith. So, and God doesn't, God doesn't just give to anybody. Are you listening to what I'm talking about? So I don't do that. But I think the guy was trying to impose his faith on his wife. 
So he brought her here, but I saw something after I prayed. Then I asked one of the guys, Reverend Sue said, Boy, you have prayed. I believe God has answered prayer, but let's take her to emergency. So I called one of the doctors I know, Raphael Hospital or something. When they go there, I even was trying to call the doctor himself to check. He said, they When they go there, the next situation, he said, No, take her to uh, Temer General Hospital. I think when you saw it, and the doctor said that he is not a gynecologist, and a gynecologist is not around. By the time he comes back, seeing the nurse showing, seeing the situation, it's not something. Yesterday, I think I slept around two o'clock. Eh? Yeah, around two. Intervention and pray. Then when they were going, this is why I deal with a lot of things here. I don't want to. Talk. The husband said, "This is an emergency." The wife had a dream that he was in police hospital. So he was going to police hospital. I told my boy Joshua, I said, interrupt the guy. You can't eat cocontain and dream. And what kind of dream is that? We went to Tema General Hospital. There was no bed. He said, he's still bleeding. I have to call my daughter, uh, Audrey, has already do something. He's one of the top doctors there. The gynecologist said, I have similar situations for already. I'm even waiting for some people to come from the theater so that I can send this one. So this one will be the fifth. So it cannot work. You have to send her something. You have to know. And there is one thing in the girl's mouth. One confession, I shall not die. I shall not. Now listen. Listen. When I was standing in her, he kept repeating, he said, Daddy, I shall not die. I will live and declare the works. Daddy, this is what you taught me. I shall not die. When Joshua then was taking her to hospital, I shall not die. I put money, I said, take her to hospital. When he went there, then one of the doctors, I call, call. He has a friend. He said, when he, he called her, the guy was asleep. So they have to rush her to her private hospital. Open the theater and do some things. Thank God. Today they call, they say, she has recovered. The doctor said, This is the fastest recovery I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. Oh, For her to walk around. Give the Lord a shout of victory. Hey. You see, it is one thing to come to prayer meeting here because you want your fiancé. But here, you will get it. No problem. But another thing we do is that we teach you things for the days of emergency he said remember your creator in the days of your youth before the evil day came." what happened to the lady was an evil day yes, when the evil day came, what do you know yesterday i was telling mama if you say i have to continue teaching the faith mercy and i have to continue strengthening people yes what do you do when you are in emergency and you go it's not the doctor's fault. The gynecologist said, the situation you brought, some are even more serious than your own. And they are in a queue. But the theater is even jar. So if you come, you will be the fifth person. And already some people were lying on the floor. That is why I said divine health is better than looking for healing. Yeah. Oh, come on, you are not listening to what I'm saying. Hey. You yeah. have to get out of your way. Hey. Are you listening to what I'm talking about? Yeah. Today, if you have to scream for the devil to leave you, scream. Yeah! If you have to shout for the devil to leave you, yeah! shout. If you have to jump for the devil to leave you, jump. Whatever you can do for the devil to leave you, yeah. give the Lord a shout. Yeah! Hey! Hey! Lift up your two hands. Today, which one are we dealing with? Colossians, take me there. Somebody says, spoke inside. Spoke inside. inside. In case you are coming here new, the word spoke inside means church. That's all. I was preaching in Kumasi, and then I said something, and somebody shouted in the congregation, spoke inside. So I didn't ask the pastor, what the, I called, I said, what did they say, Pacho, church. I said, I can't church. So the word spoke inside in the Kumasi language means church. And what are you taking the chair to ever obey? Ephesians chapter 6. 
We wrestle not against flesh and blood. Is it verse number 16? But against principalities, against powers. Uh, be strong in the Lord. Finally, my brethren. Finally, finally. So after everything, fiancé, boyfriend, everything. Finally. When you come to church, acrobatic display, gymnastic, finally. Whatever you think you believe in, finally. Paul said, when we be piano, you chat to a crowd, be strong in the Lord. Now watch this. This is a very powerful scripture. He didn't say be strong in yourself. You have to be strong in the Lord. I don't want to preach a sermon. Be strong in the Lord. So whilst you are standing here and sacrificing your bed, your bed, you are finding strength in the Lord. No, 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 no. Anytime we declare fasting and you are here, you are developing strength in the Lord. Yes. Fasting, prayer, Bible study, corporate anointing. Yes. Look at somebody and say, be strong in the Lord. Strong in the Lord. And in the power of his mind, put on the whole armor of God. That you may be able to stand against the words of the devil. Then he come and say, we wrestle not against flesh and blood. Then he started giving the hierarchy of the satanic world. But against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of darkness, and against spiritual wickedness in high places. Then he mentioned these principalities. Now, if you are very good Bible students, it doesn't mean principalities are more dangerous than wicked spirits in high places. Now, it comes from the down up here. So you see that Satan's kingdom is very organized. I told you that there are some demons Jesus has not even released them until after the rapture. Some of them are called wicked spirits in high places. Now, but if you look at the scripture very well, these ones are very strategic because these ones are the ones that witchcraft to work with. Hello. Uh, look at someone and say, I hope you are not a witch. Tell them. If it's a man, say wizard. <laughs> okay. We, we, God does not tell us yet, so we are trying to find out. But in case you have one, I keep telling you, once you are a witch, you have, you have cancelled your name from the book of life. Yeah. No witch will go to heaven. Today, may you drop the witchcraft so that you can go to heaven. Amen. Okay, watch this. So, principalities. Then, I begin to do a research on principalities. Then, we come to Colossians chapter 1. And verse number what? You remember? Verse number what? Oh, Jesus, come with you. Okay, give me Colossians chapter 1, verse 14. Till we parted. Lord, give me, me my, in whom we have redemption through his blood, even the forgiveness of sin. Huh. Uh, who is the image of the invisible God? Do you remember principalities and powers and rulers? Okay. If anybody is sitting down, he's not married, tell him your fiancé is very far. Because you are sitting down. Because somebody came to one night one day and the Lord spoke to him and said that, turn to the back and see the one standing behind. She is the one. It's not for you. It has passed. Now, the guy turned. And she saw somebody standing. God specifically said the one standing. There was another one. God said, look at your right. And the one standing. When he checked, all the ladies there were sitting. So disqualification has come into the thing. Either God is a liar or you are lying. Because God cannot lie. Then you have done something that has affected your blessing. Watch this. Who is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of every creature, whether they be what? For by him were all things created, that are in heaven and that are in earth. He created all visible and invisible. Whether they be what? Whether they be what? True. So from man, they have been telling you that every telling tree there is a throne. The moment we step here, the territorial spirits here wake up. True. Jesus has come to the industrial area. Every demon, pack your things and go. Yeah. Why? Because the earth is the Lord and the fullness thereof. Now watch this. Whether they be what? Thrones. Whether they be what? Dominions. So I told you that. You must understand this one to help you our prayer. 30 minutes of non-stop prayer. Throne. Dominion is domain where the throne controls. So the Asante, he controls the Asante region. Especially Kumasi. He doesn't control every place. He doesn't control Ghana territory. He doesn't control the Northern territory. 
once there is a throne they will give you a certain dominion or domain the word dominion comes from the word domain a certain territory you rule So whether there be prince, whether there be what thrones and dominion. Now, when there is a throne and there is a domain, a principality who was on the hierarchy of efficiency, from the wicked down to there, who were close to human beings, it means a lot of witches respond or, or, or repulse to him. Yeah. Yeah. The reason God says suffer not a witch to live is that they are the ones walking around human beings uh -huh. talking to us and reporting our system to principalities hey today every witch in your family will be judged by the power of yes God. oh i thought you would shout better than this yeah. yeah. so there is a throne and there is a domain when there is a throne and domain there must be a principality that sits in the throne. Uh -huh. hmm. This is one thing you must understand. This is one thing you must understand. Now, once you conquer Goliath, you have paralyzed all the soldiers under him. Uh, now, watch this. The battle is not about how many soldiers are armed. If you are able to bring Goliath down, it doesn't matter the ammunition they have, they will all start running away. Amen. Because it's a principle for warfare. So today, don't go and look at whoever is a witch in your family. Whoever all of them are reporting to must come down today. Yes. Now listen, I was just preaching for Bishop James from there before I was coming here. And I pick a lady. I said, somebody as if I was standing at the platform, I was ministering a lot in the prophetic. And the Lord said, when you go back now, minister a lot in the place. At, at the prayer center. Because I realized that when I go out, I minister a lot in the prophetic when I was here. But it also helped the balance over here. Then I said, I see a list of names in an office in a bank, but somebody's name is not there. And he has not been promoted because his promotion letter is, has been sat down by somebody. Mm. Then the lady, I picked her and she came. Then I said, how many years? He has worked there for how many? 29 years. And she is an acting. Do you know acting? Yes. Acting means you have some He has been acting for 10 years. Think about it. Then I pick another thing about his son in the school. Who cannot learn? He used to be sharp. Bishop James said, Bishop James pulled the thing. He said, Prof, this woman, your professor, yesterday he came to give me his son's report. And I've never told you about this. I said, Bishop, don't worry. My son, come on, come to my son. This is, I say, if, if you don't bring the evidence, I know God is talking to me. I don't need it. So I told, huh? So he showed, he said, he was talking to me. I said, and I said that, and I was standing there, I saw that the thing is like a, a principality in his family. That is dealing with everybody. So, even though, Somebody is sitting on his promotion. It is the principality who has called the person to sit on it. Today, whoever is sitting on your blessing. Hey! Ah. Ah. On this mountain, I say on this mountain. Yes. I say on this mountain. Yes. Hey, today something will happen. Yes. Yes. May the Lord go to Volta region. Yes. May the Lord go to Asante region. Yes. May the Lord go to Western region. Yes. May the Lord go to uh, Upper West. Yes. Upper East. Yes. Northern region. Yes. North region. Yes. Eastern region. Yes. 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 May the Lord go to your home yes. Yes. Say yeah. yeah. Domains, principality. So, the Swear President Mahama is holding that small, at the end of the scepter. That's a theological word, scepter. The scepter will not depart from Judah till Shiloh comes. So, you need a scepter. Now, the moment they finish swearing him, they put him on the presidential seat. But that presidential seat they put him in, it only controls the boundaries of Ghana. This is what it is. 
That is what it is. There are two things you must understand. Peter, come. Come, hurry up, hurry up. If you go to castle, stand here, and you steal the truth, it does not mean that you have removed the president. Watch this. If you succeed in doing anything to move the president out, it does not mean that you have taken the truth. So today you have to deal with both. Now let me tell, let me show you how the people are done. Some of you have gone to prayer meetings, eh? And you have managed to destroy the throne. But because a throne is a handiwork, this principality can go and order for another one. And come and put it there. In case you manage to move the principality away, once the throne is still there, the devil will find another principality to come and sit on it. How do I know? Because he came with one third of the angels in heaven. So Satan is no omnipresent. How does he cause accident in Afghanistan and in Togo and in Nigeria? He uses agents. So if there are spirit of accident, there are many so mad that they can be causing it everywhere. God is everywhere at every time. Mm -hmm. One of three God's powerful three types is omniscient, omnipresent, and omnipotent. Omnipotent means all power. Omnipresent means everywhere at every time. Omniscient means you will never die and you will be living forever. Yes. Ah. Oh, somebody is clapping better for Jesus. Yes. Are you there? So. So now, 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 say that brother. So now, today we are going to combine both. Now, as long as the president is, has a throne, and he sits on the throne, this is the last word. This is the last word. When there is a throne, there is a domain, and there is a principality, then he will need power to rule. So you, the moment you swear the president, you have given him a certain power and authority. Hey. Now, the word power is derived from the word authority. When you read the King James Version, in the book of Luke chapter 18, Luke chapter, is it Luke 10, 19? Luke 10, 19. Luke 10, 19. Luke 10, 19. King James, behold, I gave unto you what? Power. Now, it was not word translated. The word power then should be translated authority. This one. Because I'm going to explain. Uh-huh. Power is ability to do. Now, if you read, okay, this is a new King James Version. If you give me the new King James Version, I like that one, that the NIV. NIV is too much of a commentary. Behold, I gave unto you what? Authority. Now, the word authority means delegated power. It has been delegated to you. So, Mahama, we gave him the power to rule. Now, watch this. I will explain the, word, I will explain the, 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 the difference between power and authority. If a policeman is standing by the Johnson at and concussion junction and stopping the cars he's a very slim lanky guy with a very black looking very hungry suit now joshua or somebody told drives there and they see the policeman then he lifts his hand like this this man has a power then they by his power in the stance of come come sir come mm -hmm. you why not so this man see the policeman. Let me see. Or it can be a policewoman. Woman is better. Directing traffic. Mommy, come for the purpose of. This one, he works with the military or something. So, so this one is directing traffic. This one got the car and say, hey, there, no, no. Throw free up. Then he pulls him away and throw him somewhere. He has the power to take him physically and throw him. After that, the government will come and ask him, what authority do you have? Mm -hmm. Because what makes this guy stand there, this young, slim lady stand there and lift his hand and every car stop is a fact of the power that has been delegated to her. So when you see the uniform with the coat of arms, the constitution of Ghana has given her a certain authority. Hey. You didn't have any authority in yourself. Yes. But Jesus said, all authority is given unto me. Hey. And I gave unto you. Oh, you are not hey. listening to me. 
Go and say that. You are not listening to me. I have to stop it. He said, I have given. So today, the authority you are going to exercise, it is has been delegated to you by Christ. And when you lift your hand, the reason the devil must stop is because he knows the authority you are exercising. Yes. It has been given to you by Christ. What a word. It's horrible. Jesus. So, 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 if you are sitting here and say, that is why I love American police. Power near their mom, you use so many effects. Bishop, have you, have you noticed that thing? Ah! American police, when you pour Superna Jones on them, no, 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 no. Just the appearance of him can put the fear of God in you. And they know they have the power. The ex British police, British one got a moon in Papa's America phone. A two crisis said, Oh, Jesus Christ. Especially New York police. Obey you, finger free, Susan. They exercise. A lot of you are not exercising authority, authority given to you. Today you are going to exercise and you will see results. Yes. Anything God didn't give you is illegal. Rise your feet and lift up your two hands. Whether they be thrones. Hey, today when the thrones are moved, some people will get married by next month. Yes. Hey. Oh. Yes. When the thrones are moved, some people's bank account will change. Yes. When the thrones are moved, some people are going to have their children. Yes. Whatever won't let you move forward, you must move it. Yes. I shall lift up your voice in prayer. Yes. Every throne in your family, the one that was purchased by the demonic world, the one that was purchased by your great grandfather, the one in your mother's house, the one in your father's house, as you clap your hands and open your mouth in prayer, you are commanded that throne. Now, listen to me. I don't think you are ready to play. Lift up your two hands. Shut. When you are going to be a girl, this is not a prayer you joke with. Because some of you, you are dealing, we are dealing with serious things. Serious. Share. Explain why you are working 29 years, no promotion. Ade. When I was ministering to the lady, a lot of people were crying. 29 years. You are even on your way to retirement. And I love Job chapter uh, Job 1520, 2015 or 1520. He has swallowed down riches hey. and he shall vomit them up again. Hey. And God shall cast it out of his belly. Yes. yes. So there are three things. Yes. <laughs> they will vomit the wealth. Hey. So somebody's car is in the belly of the devil. Hey. Hey. Somebody sold by the blood trees in the belly of the yes. devil. Lift one say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I lift my voice in prayer. As I lift my voice in prayer. By delegated authority. I exercise that authority by the blood of Jesus. Everything that belongs to me that is in the belly of the enemy, according to Job 2015, I am commanding him to vomit it out in the name of Jesus. I can hear you in the name of Jesus. As I open my mouth in prayer, every throne in my father's house, every throne in my mother's house, every principality sitting on it. I come in the name of the Christ that died and rose again. And I declare today, your assignment has come to an end. I put an aspiring date on your presence today. As I lift my voice in prayer, may my prayer go to my father's house. May my prayer go to my mother's house. By my prayer, my brothers will be delivered. My, my sisters will be delivered. By my prayer, my family will be set free. Lift up your voice and open your mouth. Masada pa, randele ve kapa, rapandele ve kapa, shoda pa, randele ve kapa, 
Telephone plus two three 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 zero three four one three seven zero three or plus two three 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 zero three four one three seven zero five. Email us on info at wpcministries.org or visit our website at www.wpcministries.org.